But one day out of nowhere, Ada says to me, Hey, let's paint on shoes. And I'm like, okay, but, but why? And then she starts showing me all these examples online. So, okay, sure, let's try it. Let's give it a try. You know, we had a whole bunch of different paints. We tried watercolor, oil, acrylic, whatever we had, we just dumped it onto the shoe. And it turned out kind of okay. And that's when Ada's sister saw it. And she said, hey, no, these are actually all right. So then we started seriously thinking about, oh, well, maybe, maybe we can start making these and see what we can do with them. So that's when we started to uh, experiment with um, high heels because we love high heels. And we took a pair and we painted on different pair of high heels. And one time she went to a party and then one of her uh, friend or acquaintance, she's gonna open a store uh, in uh, Carousel. And then she said, hey, those are cool shoes. You wanna try to sell them at um, our store? We we're like, sure, why not? Some of the wedding orders we get, you know, it means a lot for these people to have a pair of custom shoes. And I don't wanna make it unattainable to them. So there's this dilemma of, okay, if I'm setting a price too low, I'm I'm almost putting other artists out of work because now people think, oh, you know, art is cheap, which obviously isn't true. But at the same time, I want to create art that's accessible to everybody. So it's really hard for me to find a balance. There are ways that we can make more money by, uh, for example, we partner up with someone else and Matt's produce shoes, but then it really lose the um, the quality and the meaning behind the shoes because right now we're doing uh, one of a kind shoes so each pair of shoes has its own story whereas if we do like a mass produce shoe production then it really loses the meaning behind the shoes. Uh, sitting here in the office you know typing away writing copy or thinking up ideas for advertisements is not nearly the same as having a blank canvas and doing whatever I want with it. What really motivates me to keep going and keep sketching or drawing or uh, working on the shoes is I could do whatever I want. I don't have to worry about anybody telling me, hey, you can't do this, it's not company policy, or no, um, this is against branding so we can't do it. I think um, one of the big problems a lot of artists have is that they don't know how to market themselves. And it's really a shame even if they do really great work. So it doesn't matter how good your work is, if nobody knows about it, there's not going to be a market for it. Hi, I'm Miranda. I'm one half of Coco Punks. Hi, I'm Ada. I'm the other half of Coco Punks.